If you guys are looking to buy any FIFA 17 Ultimate Team coins, make sure you go and check out igsky.com. Link down in the description below. You can use J54 at checkout for a discount. They're fast, cheap and reliable. Get your coins in whilst you can before the new cards come out next week. What's up guys and welcome to the fourth episode of More Than A Bronze. Now... We are going to be hopefully uploading a second episode tomorrow of this series. Now, if you guys want to see it, let me know right now by smashing a like. If we can smash 5,000 likes by midnight tonight, UK time, I will upload a second one tomorrow morning at 9am. And that's on Sunday. So if you're watching this at a different time, uh, then this probably is completely irrelevant to you. But yeah. If you show enough love, I will upload one tomorrow morning. Um, otherwise, it may probably be Sunday. Um, but I mean, sorry, Monday. But there's also going to be a squad builder showdown coming out tomorrow as well. So it could potentially be a bit of a double upload. So if you guys want to see it, let me know by smashing a like. This could be another sick episode. Thank you all for all for all the love on the series recently. It's been absolutely insane. Um, and yeah, we're going to first firstly kick things off by showing you guys my new team now. We had a 200,000 coin budget, um, and that 200k budget did not include Testagen, and it does not include Emre Moore, just so you guys know. At the time of buying these players, this team was 200k. Uh, thank you very much to the guy that actually recommended it. It's going to be on the screen now. Thank you very much. Um, if you guys want to go ahead and look at the team, I'll probably put the foot end link down in the, in the description below, but it's kind of, it doesn't really matter anyway, because anyway, I'm going to have the, screen on the, screen on the, uh, the team on the screen right now. So... Let's dive into this. Hopefully this team is going to enable us to climb up the ladder even more. And uh, yeah, hopefully bag ourselves a sick bench player. And hopefully upgrade one of these players to their informs. And then even have a little go on the randomizer. And potentially get an inform for the next episode. So let's move up then. Uh, we're going to show you guys the two centre-backs first of all. So we have got Ramos. And then for the left centre-back spot, we have got... Pepe. So bear in mind, we had a 200,000 coin budget for this team. Um, obviously, we got to Stegen in goal. Pretty happy that that guy did actually choose um, to keep him in the team. Right back then, we have got a pretty solid fullback, uh, and that is going to be Aurier, as you can see. Left back is going to be the Spaniard, um, and that is going to be as Equator. I feel like this guy is sometimes overlooked a little bit uh, on FIFA purely because of his 79 pace, but we're going to go ahead and actually apply anchor card to him as well uh, just to give him that little bit of an edge uh, in the pace department as well um, so let's move on now to the CDM we have got a French lad now I did mention to you guys that I wanted 100% uh, to have Kante in this team uh, and that's exactly what, what, what the guy did for me uh, he included Kante in the, in the team I did also mention that I wanted a really, really strong midfield so that when I come up against the better teams, maybe with like Ronaldo or like other teams with like Kante and stuff like that, I would be on the level playing field. Um, that's regarding the Kante quote, not the Ronaldo quote, by the way. Um, so, yeah, I, you know, I, I wanted a level playing field and I feel like this team that this guy has built me is definitely helping me uh, achieve that. So, left centre mid, sorry, we'll go for right centre mid first actually. We have got Blaise Matuidi, as I'm sure you would have guessed because you've got Aurier there. Left centre mid then, we have got Kante. Now, this is where things get a little bit interesting. We've got Modest here um, as our cam. Now, I don't know how good this guy is going to play at cam, uh, whether he's going to be good at all. I do not know, but this guy seemed to have a bit of confidence in him uh, in putting him into the team. So, I thought, you know what, let's give him a go. And then, to partner... The fire, well, to partner Emre Moore up uh, and hopefully bag us a load of goals, we have got the one, the only, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang, uh, who is just an absolute god. Both of them have got Hunter cards on. I'm going to go ahead and actually apply, apply a, chem style, a chem style to the Dest as well. Um, we are going to, let's go and have a quick look. Hopefully we have like the Hawk in here. That would be pretty nice. Uh, what have we got? Do we have any specials? Don't. Okay, right. Um, we are gonna go ahead. Oh no, we do. Sorry, I went completely went past it. I don't know what I was doing there. Anyway, we've got the hawk trait, uh, hawk chem style now on him. Uh, yeah, that's that's a pretty nice team. I think that is a pretty nice team indeed. Let's go ahead and dive into a game now. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of it. And uh, yeah, let's do this. So here we go, this is our opponent. So we have come up against, well, this guy's got Bale, he's got Griezmann, Martial, Kante, Gamero as a centre mid. So I'm guessing he's going to change something in game. 
I'm not quite sure why he'd have Gamera there, but I don't know. We'll soon find out. Um, but yeah, I mean, very nice looking team. I think we can go ahead and do the business. I'm pretty sure we will be able to. Uh, obviously, I don't know actually how good this guy's going to be, but judging on that team, I think we've got a very, very good chance of uh, going ahead and, uh, and grabbing, grabbing a few goals and going on and winning this game. Oh my god, man. That's a goal. That's, I'm just going to accept that. So shit. Go on. Here we are. Emre Moore. No rebound, though. Oh, oh, no, it's Modest. There we go. Okay, so we're back on level terms. Thank God for that. Jesus. Right, well, uh, that was not that hard. I wish we did score, though, with Emre Moore because that obviously would have sent us up the ladder one more. But, um... Yeah, I mean, Modest gets his first goal. It's not not bad. I know it was a rebound, but you got to be in the you got to be in the right places to score them. So I feel like he's done a little, you know, decent job. On, oh, he's here again. Finish it. What a goal that is. Lovely stuff. Right? Can we get rage quit? Maybe. Are we going to see a rage quit here? Is this guy changing his team up again? We've got a rage quit, ladies and gentlemen. Now, right? I am going to quickly go onto my previous video because I asked you guys what I should do. If a rage quit occurred. Now, there were a load of comments regarding that matter. There were a lot. So I think we can get a few answers here. Um, let's see what you guys have written. So, come on, let's go through. Okay. Uh, Jack, when your opponent rage quits, you do a randomizer. That is a very, very good idea. Um, another person said rage quit equals an extra 10k. Um, what else is that? Rage quit is 25k extra. I think, do you know what? I think we will do, because the randomizers are already on the wheel, it's kind of take away the fun of that. So what we're going to do, we're going to say randomizer gets us an extra 25k. So essentially we've won 25, we've won 50k from winning that match. Um, so there we go. Let's add that to the coin total. And um, yeah, happy days. Happy days indeed. Right. Okay. Well, that is basically 250k now for the next episode's team, which is very nice indeed. That was rather short-lived though. Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, dive straight into a second game because that was, uh, yeah, it didn't take very long. And also the fact that, uh, well, neither of our players actually lost any other. Oh, there was a little bit of fitness loss, but we'll top that up. Uh, but we didn't score very more, more importantly, so we can't do anything with the ladder. Uh, the next player, the next thing that we can tick off is obviously the bench player. Um, which is going to come in handy because sometimes, you know, when it gets to the end of the, end of the game, you do want to bring a fresh player on. Uh, so I think that will help us again against some better teams. And hopefully we can get the upgrade in there so we can go ahead and maybe upgrade like Matuidi or even Aubameyang um, for the rest of the episode. That is what I want to do. So let's go ahead and dive into this next game and see how we do. Here we go then. This is our opponent. So this guy has got a full Barclays Premier League team uh, looking like a very, very strong one. A few players in there that you wouldn't really associate with just like, a, like a, a very common BPL team, like the likes of Schneidlin, uh, Coquelin as well. You wouldn't, I don't, like, I don't really see them players on FIFA that often. Uh, even Shakiri as well. People like to use like Willian and stuff like that. So um, this will be interesting. I'm, I'm pretty sure I feel confident after that first game uh, that we can go ahead and grab, and grab a, a, a few goals and definitely test the guys. So let's see how things go. Um, and hopefully we can come out of a win. Oh no, I've taken my own player out. Oh my god, I'm lucky. I am lucky there. Go on. Here we go. Aubameyang. Dink him now. Yeah, no, for God's sake. I was flipping pretty much almost celebrating before it even gone in. Oh dear lord. Go on, cut him off, cut him off. Go on. What a ball that is. Bang it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Have we not scored? How have we not scored? I was going to chip him as well, and I decided not to. No, that's that is so lucky, man. So lucky. It is unbelievable. Oh, that's how can you flipping stop the game there? Does not make sense. Anyway, you flipping lost that game. Oh my god, that is so frustrating. That was just like a game which you just don't want to be involved in, ever. How annoying is that then? Okay, right, well we're going to go again. Uh, we have got another game to play anyway with this team. I really don't know whether I like this team. I really don't know yet. Uh, we haven't even scored with Emery Moore this episode, so we've really got to get a move on. Um, 
I'm hoping this game is the one. I'm hoping this game we can really go out and uh, and grab some goals around more because we need some. We need some badly. So fingers crossed we can do just that. That is the aim. Let's see what we can bag ourselves. Come on. Okay, so this is our next opponent. This guy's got a full Serie A side, of course. Well, with uh, Sirigu in goal, who's obviously from the La Liga. But uh, he's got Dybala, Immobile, um, the squad builder challenge Higuain, who's obviously insane, Nainggolan, Hamshik, Marquisio all in the midfield, and of course, a fantastic defence as well. This will be tough, but look, we can do it. We can do it. I know we can. We just need to be a little bit more clinical, pass, and, pass, and, pass the ball a little bit quicker, and uh, I think we'll be fine, but let's see what we can do. Oh, I can't move! Of course it's a goal. Go on, Emre Moore, bang that. Oh my God, oh my days. I can't, I just give up. If that's not going in, I have no idea what's gonna go in. My God, man. That should have been a flipping goal. Seriously, should have been. Go on. Go on. Oh, I forgot. Get the rebound. It's going in. Come on. There we go. 1-1. One, one. Somehow we've managed to score there. I do not know how. We need to get Aubameyang though on the score sheet. We really... I mean, Aubameyang, Emre Moore. It is so frustrating. Far too frustrating now. Right, okay. There we go. That is the halftime whistle. Yeah, I've been absolutely bombarded. I probably don't deserve to be 1-1, but we have had some good chances. I should have put one away with Emery Moore as well. Here we go. Through ball. Oh, Emery Moore. Sirigu too quick off his line. No good. Oh, here we go. Go on. Finish that now. Oh, and he scored. Aubameyang has made it 2-1. Look at that. Just why can't that be Emre Moore in that position? It's so annoying. So annoying. But yeah, I do not know how we're uh, how we're this far. I need to stop Emre Moore there. That's when I need to stop him. And we bloody have. Jesus. Didn't expect that. I'll tell you that. Go on. Go on. Go on. Here we are. Finish that. Oh my God, no. Bloody hit the... Flipping crossbar, whatever it was. I don't even know what that was. Emre Moore, how much closer can you get to scoring than that? No, 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 no. Yes. Get there. No, he stopped, bloody. Get it out, you. So stupid, man. So stupid. Ah, oh, that is the luckiest goal ever. That is the luckiest goal. So flipping close. Great ball. Bang it. Oh, he's gone in. Emre flipping more in the final minute. That is so lucky. That was horrendous goalkeeping, but we've played an absolutely sensational ball. Look at this run from Emre Moore. Bang first time. Got that one touch. That was actually quite a nice, quite nice. Oh my God. Right. We've got to be careful here. We've got to be careful. Just take him out. Oh God. There we go. That's what we want to see. That is what we want to see. Go on. And again. And again. Just run. Just run, Aubameyang. Run. 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 Here we go. Go on. Oh my god, Emre scores a second. We have got two of the flipping ladder. What a twist in the tail that is. A fantastic run from Aubameyang. Emre Moore with the perseverance to get in front of his defenders. Absolutely quality. Absolutely. This guy is not happy. I would not be happy. Jesus Christ, he almost scored there. <laughs> oh my God. But, um, oh my days. Just at the scenes. The scenes, ladies and gentlemen. The absolute scenes. I can't believe that. I can't believe that. So, basically, we have got, for the next episode, uh... An upgrade. In fact, you know what? We might... Shall we play another game? Shall we play another game? Do I play another game? No, we'll save this. We'll save this because I really am... I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm not really getting on with this team. I'm not going to lie. Um, so, we have basically got... Okay, right. This is actually quite decent for you guys because you guys can tell me everything that I need for the next episode. So, I won two of my games, didn't I? I got one rage quit. So, I've basically got 275,000 coins to build a team for the final... 
yeah, 275,000 coins to build a team. Um, I would like it to be a hybrid, obviously around Emre Moore, preferably using a 4-3-1-2 formation. Uh, whatever players you want, I need an OP defence. Um, bear in mind, one of the players can get a free upgrade. And also, I need you guys to let me know in the comment section below a bench player which I should add uh, that we can super sub on whenever we're in need. That is what I need. I need your guys' support. So, um, yeah, let me know in the comment section below all the things that I've mentioned uh, just now. It'd be great if you guys could show me some, uh, yeah, just some ideas and all your suggestions. That'd be absolutely amazing. Like I said, 5,000 likes. That'd be absolutely incredible. And I'll upload another one tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.